if you have not subscribed to my channel then please subscribe immediately and even share it with your family and friends and don't forget to like it pisces here's your september 2024 monthly prediction welcome to september pisces this month brings fresh starts in relationships plus potential turmoil mid-month due to an eclipse in your sign during august you fought for your work life balance and survived yet another mercury retrograde while mercury's backward dance may have caused communication issues the real overhaul you see regarding how you express yourself begins on sunday september 1st when uranus the eccentric wild child of the zodiac goes retrograde in your third house, in a backward dance that will last between now and the end of January. During this time, you are tasked with identifying what's working for you and what isn't. Also, on Sunday, September 1st, Pluto, the makeover planet, which is also currently retrograde, moves into your 11th house of friendship. This combination of influences asks you to check in to see if you're being honest with your friends and lovers about how you feel. Additionally, you might want to ask yourself if past trauma is hindering your current relationships and communication style. If so, implement a self-care plan that can help you address it. Since the effects of Uranus and Pluto retrograde will play out over several months they're not likely to cause any noticeable disruptions. However, you might turn a new leaf in your relationships around the Virgo new moon in your 7th house of partnership on Monday, September 2nd. This lunar phase is associated with fresh starts and sees you swiping on someone you end up dating or working up the courage to be honest about your feelings in an existing relationship. And just a few days later, on Wednesday, September 4th, fighter planet Mars moves into your fifth house of pleasure, helping you identify and assert your desires, especially as they pertain to sex. But it's not just your romantic and sexual relationships that get an upgrade this month. When Pallas, the asteroid of wisdom, moves into your social 10th house on Sunday, September 8th, you may see someone in your friend group differently. This could shake off rosy glasses regarding a fake friend but also see some Pisces realizing that they have romantic feelings for someone in their social circle. With divine messenger Mercury moving into your partnership-oriented 7th house on the same date, Sunday, September 8th, you're able to find the word to deal with such changes and express yourself. Freeing yourself from various debts and obligations will free you to take a big leap into the next chapter of your life. As you gear up for the first of a series of eclipses in your rising sign this month, you'll also be working out a few remaining kinks in the realm of, who still owes who, how do we unyoke ourselves from a bad deal that's not mutually beneficial, and, how are these lingering dregs of grief keeping me from moving on out of a misplaced sense of loyalty. But if status quo is what you're sick of, then fear not. The lunar eclipse in Pisces on September 17th gets the most stagnant waters to flow again, and you'll soon be riding a new wave of opportunity, inspiration, and momentum. Whether that looks like feeling pregnant with plans and ideas after a long dry spell or actually going through with significant new beginnings in September, it's important to trust your instincts right now, even if you can't see how all of this is going to unfold yet. Doubt and skepticism can be healthy in small doses, but you've probably had more than your fill of that already. Look for people who pop up in your sphere and illuminate the ways you've been unnecessarily hard on yourself or self-limiting in your beliefs, especially around the Sun-Saturn opposition on September 8th. Some of the new storylines beginning now might involve a new labor of love, hobby, or project you'll be taking up in September, but maybe one you'll need to be sufficiently emotionally invested in to drum up the necessary motivation. Notice where your enthusiasm naturally flows, because you might end up having to quit certain pastimes later this winter if there's conflict where there should be ease. If you have children, or work closely with young ones, they could also start acting out more than usual this month. Handling their unruly behavior might feel like waging a war that has no rules, and unfortunately one that might drag on for months. Try not to feel discouraged if your current approach isn't working. There will be opportunities, and maybe even a necessity, to change your tactics later. However, be aware of planning any first dates or important discussions on or around Tuesday, September 17th. There's a full moon and lunar eclipse in your sign, Pisces. Lunar eclipses can bring sudden and unexpected endings, paranoia, and all-around icky feelings, so you'll want to take it easy. However, 
Once the sun moves into relationship-oriented Libra, affecting your sexy 8th house on Sunday, September 22nd, you'll have plenty of opportunities to address the changes. The start of Libra season, Sunday, September 22nd, is also the fall equinox, meaning the hours of light and dark are of equal length. This date is also Mabin, aka Witchy Thanksgiving. Celebrate by taking the time to note all the love around you, even if your relationships are in the middle of a makeover. On this date, lover Venus also moves into sexy Scorpio, which adds a sultry air to all interactions. September is all about your relationships, Pisces, and all of these changes can be a lot, even if they're for the best, which they always are. On Thursday, September 26, the communicator Mercury moves into your 8th house, which is highly erotic but also rules makeovers, so it will affect all of your relationships, not just the sexy ones. Use this transit, highlighted by Mabin, to try to be in the moment and practice mindfulness. Sometimes, when we're going through a lot, the best we can do is take things moment by moment. You've got this, and we'll see you in October. Subscribe to Highest Good. Thanks for watching. To get your daily prediction updates from our team of psychics, subscribe to Highest Good and click on the bell notification and never miss a prediction.